Not guilty of the plea from the former president, not surprisingly, in a very short appearance here in this courthouse in Washington, D.C., a very short walk away from the U.S. Capitol. It was just under 30 minutes that Donald Trump spent in this courtroom. He was sitting at the defendant's table, flanked by his two lawyers, saw the judge, uh, the uh, special counsel as well, and uh, was able to put in that not guilty plea. And that was pretty much it from the former president. He spent a very short time here in the U.S. Capitol and flew off again to his golf club in New Jersey. Just about enough time for him to give a very short statement to media on the tarmac here at the airport, decrying uh, this case again as political interference and criticizing the city in which it is taking place as well. Uh, now it's a big logistical challenge that is coming Donald Trump's way, as, long as, as well as, of course, a huge legal challenge, because this is a man who's campaigning for the White House. He is the favorite to become the nominee for the Republican Party. He will continue on the campaign trail, all the while having to defend himself, together with his lawyers, in three separate courtrooms, in three criminal cases, in three separate U.S. cities. And the next court dates are coming. The 28th of August, we will see the next hearing here in Washington, D.C., in this criminal case, though Donald Trump is not necessarily expected to attend that hearing. Something that was different here compared to other uh, indictments that he has faced was the context here. There were no mass demonstrations for Donald Trump or indeed against him here. He had not put out a call for his supporters to come out here en masse, and indeed they didn't. Just a few dozen Trump supporters here at best, and quite a few people here as well to celebrate his indictment. Again, quite a lot of court dates to come for the, pre the former president, all while he campaigns again for the White House. Philip Crowther with the Associated Press for CGTN in Washington.